All right. Good morning. Please give me your full name. My name is Anissa Kaika. All right. Nice to meet you. And my name is Eva. Nice to meet um, you too. <laughs> my first question is, what is the purpose of your trip to the United States? I am a student, so I'm going to pursue my bachelor's degree at biology in Southwest Minnesota State University. All right. And what made you choose this particular university? I chose this university because of their strong focus on URC program, undergraduate research conference, especially for a biology major, where I can get a chance for professional research and ideas exchange opportunity with field experts. And I'm particularly excited to learn from Dr. Dissuger, who is a specialist in plant taxonomy and conservation botany. My goal is to specialize in this area, and I'm a person who loves to stick in with nature, so Minnesota's rich biodiversity make it an ideal place to live and learn. So yeah, it's perfect for my academic goal and personal interest. That was very good. All the details about the school, but also about the community and everything. Very, very good. Thank you. Um, can you explain your course of study and how it relates to your future career goals? Um, my course is to bachelor in biology and I will be learning about the genetics, uh, ecology and bioinformatics and biodiversity and uh, and I want to become a conservation botanist at Nepal's Ministry of Forest and Environment, where I plan to develop conservation strategies and protect our botanical heritage. So yeah, this course will help me to get of my dream in real life. Very good, very good. Um, how did you find out about this university? My consultancy suggested me this university, and I researched and joined the webinar. Um, webinar by the university and I connected with the professor and admission team. Then I talk with them, they provide me information about the course and curriculum, hostel facilities, about their community and the natural resources available. And yeah, so that's, why, that's how I chose this university. All right, very good. And what is your educational background? I have done my high school uh, at Junior Citizens Academy in 2023 with science faculty uh, and with biology major with 3.14 CGP. All right. Sounds good. And have you received any scholarships? Yes, I have. Aid? I have received 1,000 scholarships. All right. Very good. Um, and then if there's any like future plans that you have for scholarships after you've applied and been accepted, have have you applied and been accepted yet? You need the visa for that, right? Yeah. Yeah. I okay. Need visa for that. So if there are like more plans that you have for after, you can mention that. Say, and after I apply, get accepted, I plan to um, apply for more scholarships. Yeah, so yeah. yeah, very good. But yeah. specifics, very good. Um, and do you have any friends or relatives in the United States? Yeah, I do have some friends in the United States, but in other university and other state. All right, sounds good. And yeah, if they ask you about the relatives then or friends, you can say, yeah, I have these friends, but then be specific about your intentions for primarily going to study, not just for social connections. Okay. So very good, very good answer. Um, and what are your plans after completing your studies? As I said, my dream is to become a conservation botanist at Nepal's Ministry of Forest and Environment, where I plan to develop conservation strategies to protect our herbal and endangered plant species and their habitats. And I aim to lead projects to restore degraded ecosystem and advocate for policies that protect our botanical heritage. So yeah, through this effort, I hope to preserve our Nepal's unique plant biodiversity. All right, very good. And yeah, if you even want to talk about like why that personally matters to you, you know, um, the environment, how how you personally chose that, that would be good too. But very good answer. Yeah. Um, and how do you plan to finance your education in the United States? My parents and my sister will fund me. Uh, my father is in Qatar, works for a Taisha company as a security in charge since 20 years and my mother runs our grocery store here in Pokhara and my sister is in Japan, works for a Marijan company as a production manager 
and we have total annual combined income of 49,000 US dollar and apart from that we have savings of 37,000 US dollar in my mom's bank account for my further education in the United States. All right, yeah. sounds good. Um, very good with all the details. Uh, what ties do you have to your home country that will ensure your return after studying? Yeah, my pa I have seen my parents struggling to give best for me, so I have responsibility towards them after completing my study. And as I said earlier, my dream is to become a conservation Buddhist at Nepal's Ministry of Forest and Environment. So that's why I'm going to United States to pursue a, uh, my study in biology to get uh, international knowledge and skills to contribute based in the field of biology here in Nepal. So I will surely return back to Nepal after completing my study. <laughs> All right, very good. And how will you adapt to cultural differences in the United States? I will research, understand, uh, understand the curriculum, policies, and the assessment methods. And I will also be open to learn from educators and students to bridge any gaps in my understanding. All right, very good. <laughs> and any like campus activities or anything that you're interested in, you can talk about those there too. Yeah. Um, have you ever been to the United States before? No, no. All right. That is the end of my questions. You did very good, just giving very clear and concise, detailed answers, um, talking about your plans specifically, um, your career goals specifically, all very good. Very good job. And I'm happy to grant your visa. Thank, thank you. Thank you so yes, much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Have thank a great you. day. You Enjoy. too. You too. It was